Hey guys, Michael Stillwell from Stillwell Pianos in Mesa, Arizona. And I am sitting in front of a 1985 Kimball piano, an American piano. This is a five foot one. And this is actually a commemorative piano because in 1984, Kimball uh, was in charge of the uh, winter, I think it was winter Olympics or summer Olympics, but summer Olympics, yes, summer Olympics, I'm hearing from off camera, um, halftime show. So they stacked all these pianos on top of each other and uh, kind of like the Hollywood squares where they had all black and white different Kimballs. And this piano was one of the ones that they, the same model that they put up there. It wasn't on the stage or anything, but um, in fact, it was made after the World Olympics anyways. But this is the model that they used. We really like these pianos because they're handmade American pianos. They do have a wet sand casted plate, which gives it kind of this more warmth, rich uh, sound, more of a bell-like tone and less um, kind of that tinny, bright, biting sound that we hear from a lot of Asian pianos. Um, and as you can see, it's in a really beautiful hand-rubbed mahogany finish, and the finish is pretty flawless. I mean, this is a 1985 piano, so it's 34 years old, but um, it's in really, really good condition. I'll play it a little bit for you so you guys can kind of hear what it sounds like. Once again, I'm not the best player in the world, but hopefully this will uh, help you understand what this thing sounds like. That's that kind of American growl that we talk about a lot of times with Mason and Hamlin, Steinway, Kanabi, Baldwin. And that's very typical of an American piano. So down here, we want that kind of warm sound, but also that kind of punchy, growly sound that you get from um, American pianos. So guys, if you have any questions about this particular piano or any other pianos on our website or anywhere else, always feel free to shoot me an email at michael at stillwellpianos.com. Thanks for watching, guys.